I'm so happy you can come over. And I'm really happy that you were able to let yourself in. So you're comfortable. Comfortable enough to enter my home without making me aware. I guess that's why I gave you a spare key, though, huh? <laughs> oh, I'm not mad. I'm really happy. Um, do I make you uncomfortable? It's just a little question. I just want to make sure before I progress. <laughs> Good. Why don't you get comfortable? Your comfort has been on my mind a lot lately. So much so that I tidied up a little bit. <laughs> I know if you look around, it still looks a bit... Well... Messy. But I cleared the cobwebs. At least from here. I moved them to the basement. <laughs> so when I need time to be happy, time to just unwind and be calm, I can go down to the basement <laughs> and be one with the cobwebs. <laughs> It was pretty difficult keeping them intact, if that's the right word to use. I didn't want to mess up their shape. All things get a little messed up, though, once they're moved around. You probably agree, though. <laughs> so I've been doing a lot of thinking about you, about me. About us. <laughs> As you can tell, I'm probably a little nervous. I say probably, because I don't know if this is fear or excitement I'm experiencing. Maybe both. Are you comfortable? Your smile says yes, but your eyes say no. Tell me, buddy, what's bothering you? What could I, your best friend, do to make you feel more at home? Oh, <laughs> you're just being nice. I know my home isn't perfect, but I'm glad you're willing to lie to me to make me feel better. Would you like anything to drink? I have plenty of beverages. Things that could satisfy your thirst. <laughs> or if you're hungry, I might have a little snack or two lying around. Mm. You're right. I did have something I wanted to talk to you about. I... Oh, what's this strange feeling? It's like an internal force field keeping my words inside. Do you know how that feels? Maybe I need to go to my happy place for a moment. Would you like to go into the basement with me? With the cobwebs and my collection of items. <laughs> you know my items. I've shown you them before. Because I trust you. I trust you so much that I'm willing to tell you how I feel. And I won't let this force field stop me. This internal force field. I seem to have fallen for you. 
I invited you over to tell you. My heart yearns for yours. <laughs> Silly me, I meant yearn. As you can tell, I guess I am a bit more nervous. But don't let that bother you. Take it as a compliment. This nervousness is a good thing. It means what I feel for you. How I feel for you is genuine. I hope I'm making myself clear. I'm in love with you. You're the only person who's ever tolerated me. Who hasn't shown me any sense of fear. Maybe confusion. Maybe some hesitation. Like the time I wanted to go on a picnic with you. But the location was a bit unsettling. <laughs> Not my words, but your facial expression. But unsettled is not the same as fear. But you get that, don't you? <laughs> I hope you don't think I'm weird or crazy. I was just born with a more creepy demeanor. This is who I am. If you do not feel the same, you could leave. You could even disregard our friendship and pretend like everything I've shown you never existed. Like my jars of old and rare items that I could never depart from. You could forget about everything. And I would get over it over time. I hope. I'm not used to the sensation of love. But if you're curious enough to try, I'd love to go on a date with you. Or maybe, just maybe, you feel the same. Somewhere inside, past the hesitation, past the confusion, you feel the same, and you want to be with me, <laughs> and you want to be in love with me. How do you feel? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to catch you off guard. But how? I feel like I've always been honest with you. This shouldn't be a surprise. I'm very fond of you. Uh, oh. I guess my way of expressing... Expressing... <laughs> emotions is a bit, um... Different. Maybe being more calm is a bit more unsettling. I should have practiced my excitement more. To show you my genuineness. <laughs> show you that I truly love you. I mean, you should have known as soon as you entered. Seeing my place more organized. No cobwebs in this room. What do you say? Do you have feelings for me? Is this a mutual thing? Or maybe... Maybe... You're curious enough to give me a chance. And you want to go on a date with me. Or you want to pretend this didn't happen. And you want to leave. That's fine as well. I would never keep you here if you didn't want to be here. Because I love you so much... 
I'm willing to set you free. I guess that would imply that you're not free currently. It's just a figure of speech. <laughs> My figure of speech. So what do you say? <sighs> so you're willing to give this a chance? <sighs> Wonderful. I already have something planned. <laughs> Follow me to the basement. Oh. Sure, we can go out if you want to. Whatever you're more comfortable with.